Hey Geek Family, we're back. This time we're going to check out the song Binta Dil from the movie Padmabat. And I'm Nathan. I'm Rachel. Trinity. Troy. Jordan. The whole gang is here today, ladies and gentlemen. Uh, hooray for all of us. Uh, yeah, we're going to check out the song from the 2018 movie Padmabat. Uh, we did do a trailer <laughs> review. A little bit ago for that we've also checked out a couple songs on it so uh, we should have these at least a couple of those in the links at the end of the video uh, but real quick before we check this out I just want to say thank you guys again for your support on the channel and if you can can you guys hit that like and the subscribe button followed you know what's coming by the notification bell bang, bang. hey all right uh, and real quick too I want to put a little bit of stuff to rest here uh, we just had our fast and the furious nine trailer reaction up I did a real quick scroll down through the comments, which again, I always say don't do, stay away from the comments. Uh, but I had to reply to a couple people because they're calling us out for calling out Fast and the Furious 9 over the top versus our Boggy 3 over the top. Uh, let me set a couple things straight. I think I mentioned it in the video. I even may have mentioned it in the Boggy 3 stuff, but it may have gotten lost um, through the two videos. Let me just say one, Fast and the Furious 9 is set in a franchise that when the movies started off, the franchise started off, it was grounded more in reality, and over time it got super ridiculous and over the top. I am personally not a fan of that stuff. If you're going to be over the top and ridiculous, do it from the start, not at the end. That's just me. Case Another case in point, the Die Hard franchise started off cool, mostly set in reality. Eh, then pretty soon at the end, John McClane was some over-the-top superhero. Don't like it. Thought thought they were garbage and trash. Terminator. Uh, Terminators, even yeah. though they're set in sci-fi stuff, uh, they even still got more over-the-top. Uh, but one, let me just say this franchise that's been over the top and I do like is the Mission Impossible franchise. I yes. love the over the top stuff in that franchise. They do it very well and very good. The Boggy franchise, I have not seen it yet. It seems like from the trailers from the first one we've seen all the way through to the third one that they are following the over the top action stuff. I'm not sure. I may watch the movies eventually at some point and not like them and think that, you know what, that over the top does not work and it's garbage. I don't know. Give me a chance or give all of us a chance to check that out and uh, see for herself. But Word. that being said, let's go ahead and check this song out. <laughs> that was a mouthful. It was. Got heated. What is happening? I don't Why know. Why is he arching back so far? Yeah, what is happening? <laughs> Yes, Trini, that's the guy you said that looks like Scar. Yes. And he has a scar. Okay, that is pure conceit right there. Oh, he's very vain, right? Vain, yeah. yeah. Nope, right there, perfect. <laughs> it's like, oh, I'm too much to look at, so I'm too beautiful. Mm -hmm. I thought that was him. Right. What, in the bed? Yeah. Oh. I was like, what's he doing? He's carrying that short everywhere he goes. I'm waiting for something to catch on fire. Like the girl for one. Oh, I thought he was about to drink that. <laughs> I was like, that's oil in it. Mm-hmm. Is he gonna light himself on fire? Maybe that's why the guy got the flame away. I think it's uh, blacked out there. Whatever. You're younger than me, boy. <laughs> You're younger than me, boy. 
<laughs> Doesn't it hurt to reach that far? <laughs> it does, but it's worth it. <laughs> uh, but it's worth it. Alright, I'm gonna speak first. Alright, Trini. <laughs> I have to say, that was beautiful. <laughs> what was beautiful about that? The song. The song, the song, was the song beautiful. itself. The song was beautiful. Yeah. yeah, I love the song. That Rachel, was beautiful. what was man. beautiful about oh, that? Oh. <laughs> the man. This guy singing. I like that song, guy. Yeah. Like, I think he looks like Scar. I like his hair. Oh, the the, the act. Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. I thought you were talking about the guy who was singing. Um, don't he know himself. what was going on there. Well, That's I, his character. Mm -hmm. Yeah, but um, I thought that song was freaking beautiful. Like, I actually like that song a lot. Just yeah, music video aside, because it got kind of got kind of got kind of risque at the end there. Mm -hmm. uh, but that put aside, the song itself, the sound of the music, the beat of it, and everything. His voice, yeah. Uh, his voice was very well, very uh, soothing song. It was. It made me want to walk through the desert in the Egyptian times on a camel's Egyptian back. times mean yeah. the ancient times. Like ancient Egypt. Yeah. Like, oh. I don't know, just put me in it. I don't know, put me I mean, there's world. Egyptians still alive today. I can so. see that on a camelback going th going through the dunes at nightfall. You got the wide open sky. No water. That's what I'm talking about. Yeah, Trini will no be water. on her camel. I'll be on my camel. We'll just be <laughs> going. Earbuds in. Where you? Jordan and I will be relaxing by the pool at the hotel. This is what we'll be doing, Trini. Because you know, camels are kind of like, you're kind of like this on camels. And I'll, I'll be going be looking. this. Yeah, Trini probably. Because I can't ride in a camel. She's gonna break I swear that chair. to God, you're going to break that chair. Yeah, I can see you also, Trini, going like this, being like, I'm going to throw up, Dad. <laughs> <laughs> and then Barf is just flying like this. <laughs> <laughs> I'm going to just fly past you guys on my dirt bike. I, I really so. like that song. Like, I, I'm, so. I think I'm going to download that song. Very soothing. Um, Padma. I agree. It was a very soothing song. Uh, I didn't really uh, get the whole video to it. I know it's part of a movie. I didn't either. But uh, it was still a very, very nice song. Like, that guy can sing pretty good. Yeah. He, you know what? I was, I was going to say, he also, the guy, the person singing in the video, looked like uh, he bore a striking resemblance to Sasha Baron Cohen. <laughs> You're Sorry, right. Who? Yeah, Sasha Baron, the Borat guy who plays Borat. Or Ali G. Oh, my gosh. You don't know who Ali G is? What? From what? Borat. Borat. He's a British actor. Anyway, um, <laughs> why? I hopefully there British. you guys would have just seen a side by side. I thought he did resemble him a little bit. Uh, Rachel, what did thou think? If. If the father this of this. Go with. I liked the music, not so much the video. <laughs> if. What was wrong why? with thy video? video I figured that video would be right up your alley, right up your book rack. Yeah. Whoa. What? Right, some kind crack. of shredded guy dancing, looking, looking at himself in mirrors, oil porn, porn on oil, his body. yeah, almost set himself on fire. He the guy's like, Whoa, it. oh my god, I didn't realize that they're putting oil on his body and he had fire. What, Unless it was what is wrong with y'all? <gasps> what did you say? Or was it oil? He got resistant? caught on fire. Or was, or was it just water? All right, yeah, I guess oh, Troy. Last but not least, we got Troy, and I know he absolutely dug it. Meh. Nah, see, he's saying I, I didn't really like it. I don't. Are you serious? Because I only like music like that if it picks up and gets like really like, epic at like Built the halfway into the in. action. Like, like, like basically like battle music. That's like the only type of music I like that has that type of like slowness battle to music. it. Because mm. it's slow at first and it builds up. That's the only type of music I like that has that part in it. You know what song that makes me think? And I don't know why, but when he had the torch and he was like in the water and just like moving around like this, that looked like something Captain Jack Sparrow would do. <laughs> it kind of did. It kind of did. And, and that looked, you know, when he was in the, in like the bath area doing that with the flame, that looked kind of cool watching him the way he was kind of moving back and forth, watching the flame kind of dance around a bit. Uh, I thought that looked kind of cool. Dancing was fire. I really like this song. Yeah, yeah. Like um, Trinity said, video the actual video aside, the song itself, uh, very beautiful. really good. Yeah, very beautiful song, very soothing song. Uh, me and Trinity have already decided we're gonna ride camels through the desert, listening to Bindadi. That's what we're gonna do. Uh, let us know in the comments down below what you guys thought, or on our Twitter and Instagram. You guys can hit us up there. So thank you guys again so much for all your love and support on the channel. Uh, please remember, this is all in good fun. We love you guys. Peace. Bye, guys. Don't poke. I'll poke. Don't you poke. I will hit. Oh. I will hit. Where's it going? <laughs> I will hit. Let's play. Can we touch Jordan's heart? Stop. Get him. Stop. Get him. Get him. Stop. This, this, this.